I'm sure in her heart, she knows if we can help somebody from not being hurt out there like she was, make a big difference. She knows we'll do it. A Freehold family is turning the tragic loss of their daughter into a foundation to help others. We've been uh, trying to get the foundation up and running, you know, uh, since uh, Stephanie passed. Um, so we finally formed it. Uh, the Stephanie Nicole Pars Foundation was formed. Stephanie Pars, a 25 year old who loved makeup, art and children, was found dead in a wooded area off Route 9 in Old Bridge just three months after her disappearance. Her ex-boyfriend was named a suspect in her murder, but won't face prosecution as he took his own life less than a month after Stephanie's disappearance. Yeah, the mission overall is to um, you know support and to intervene with the uh, domestic violence, sexual assault, and uh, missing loved ones. The foundation, currently made up of a board of trustees and 50 members, will undergo extensive training to learn how to respond to calls regarding domestic violence, sexual assault, and missing children. We're going to make uh, response teams for missing persons, so we'll have response teams throughout the counties, uh, throughout the state. Uh, so that's all in progress. While the Pars family and their team work on getting the nonprofit fully operational to help others suffering in situations like Stephanie, they just awarded their first two scholarships. We just gave uh, our first two scholarships away. Somebody that showed ability towards leadership, okay, um, and uh, basically exemplified what it meant to be a, a student athlete, you know, while, while doing that. And we have picked a uh, out of all the applicants that put, turned in, there was two, two winners and um, both seniors from the high school. And uh, we, they, were, they, were, they were like ecstatic when they won it, <laughs> of course. And um, we were able to get that taken care of. So you know, it was just one step in the right direction to you know, get something started anyway. The Stephanie Nicole Pars Foundation is looking to add more help to the team. Members must be 18 years old and will undergo a background check. To apply, you can reach out to the Pars family directly through Facebook. They are expecting to launch their website in September. Reporting for New Jersey News Network, I'm Heather Fordham.